Tyler Hero was drafted by the Miami Heat in the first round of the 2019 NBA Draft. He was later named to the NBA All-Rookie Second Team in 2020. In just his first two seasons with the Heat, he's achieved a career highlight of a Second Team All-SEC for 2019 and was named the best shooter in 2019 by his fellow rookies. He has a net worth of around $5 million, and you're probably wondering how much he spends or what he spends all that on, rather. From fancy cars to personal chefs and uh, even for gifts for his relatives, here's how Tyler Hero spends his millions. First of all, his apartment, uh, the six foot five point guard, spends a staggering $5,000 a month on his apartment rent, which means through his first year in Miami, Tyler spent a total of $60,000 in his rent, which is definitely more than what many people make in a year. Using that hefty chunk of money for rent each month might not seem like the smartest financial decision. After all, people would argue that it would be smart to invest that money into buying a home. But for Tyler, I mean, that doesn't really matter. He probably just doesn't want anything permanent yet. And he's not the first celebrity to have this sort of mentality either. However, there's no guarantee that Tyler will end up staying with the Miami Heat long term anyways, so yeah. During an interview with GQ Sports, he mentioned how he spent his first million. His first ever purchase was a $5,000 Gucci purse for his mom, just to show how much she meant to him. Tyler said, The very first thing I bought, I think it was a Gucci purse for my mom. He added, I was in New York with some friends, and I'd just seen it at the Gucci store and bought it for her. Cars are another thing that most rookies buy with their first million. For Tyler, after making his first million in the NBA, he bought himself two different cars. I bought two cars. I bought a Jeep and then a Mercedes, Hero said. I got an S-Class S63 AMG 2020 Mercedes. I bought it at a dealership in Kentucky, and they sent it down here. It was $200,000. Under the hood of the S63 is the handcrafted V8 engine with 603 horsepower, which makes it the fastest among the S-Class vehicles. Tyler added by saying that even though he spent $200,000 bands on the Mercedes, he had to pay an extra few honeys to get the windows tinted. He also said, I bought the Jeep from a dealership down here in Miami, a, a customized one. We used to take off the top sometimes when it gets too hot. He said that it cost him about $60,000. The Wrangler is highly customizable, which has made it a favorite for celebrities looking for a creative way to express themselves. It's also used by celebrities like Floyd Mayweather Jr. and Chris Brown. Miami Heat's guard is impressive, not only as a professional basketball player, but as a professional superstar since his draft night. He's also got a lot of money and time spent into keeping his, uh, his fits among the best in the league. Hero's confidence allows him to play basketball at the very highest level, which translates to his fashion choices. His desire to stand out was clear when he showed up to the draft day wearing a suit. And since then, he's continued to put effort into his appearance once he got more money. During an interview we had with GQ Sports, he said that he loves going to South Beach to look for clothes. He then gave a shout out to a place called Webster's and his current favorite brand, Christian Dior. Hero spent a total of $85,000 on clothing in his first years, which proves that he's just a rich young man. He also mentioned that he didn't forget his past and shared that his favorite brand before making money was PacSun. Another note, Tyler Hero has his own personal chef, which he hired paying nothing less than $20,000 a year, which I I'm not sure how the chef industry works, but that had better not be his annual wage. I don't think that that wouldn't make sense. I'm moving on. During the interview, he mentioned that his nutritionist and his chef worked together to help him eat better. He also mentioned that he liked chicken and shrimp, and he didn't have to have a least favorite food. He doesn't have a least favorite food, and if he doesn't like the food, he won't eat it. I guess it's as simple as that when you get rich. As people get more money, one of the first things they do is remember how to show appreciation to their parents. Hero showed this to a surprising degree of maturity and thoughtfulness when it came down to celebrating the newfound wealth by buying his mother a car. Not just an ordinary car, but a Porsche worth 80,000 buckaroonies. He's always said he wants to buy his mom a car as one of the first, like, nice things he did for her once he got paid. You know, once he got rich and famous. I do that all the time. Once I'm rich and famous, I'm gonna blah, so and so and so. All the time. Anyways. He said, Someone delivered it one day, she came outside and saw it was in our driveway. She was just very excited and she couldn't believe it, and then she got into the car and took it for a ride. His mom will definitely be driving like the wind in this bad boy. Tyler is the very definition of not forgetting your parents once you've made it. He proved himself again by also buying his dad a car. He said, Well, I'm my dad, he likes trucks, so I got him a GMC truck for around 40000 uh, The GMC truck has a great look and it happens to be a perfect ride for a truck-loving man. 
Tyler Hero really knows how to spend his moolah right. During an interview, he said he eats out a lot. He dines out at his favorite restaurant in Miami, like Prime 112, where he spends $10,000 on dining alone per year. After being drafted into the NBA, Tyler Hero took his friends out to celebrate and spent a few th dozen thousand at the club. Sorry, that's just a staggering amount. Apparently, it's a tongue-twisting amount of money. To most basketball players, endorsement deals are very important, and the same goes for Tyler. The 13th overall pick in the 2019 NBA draft seemed to have luck on his side during his debut season. Among his draft classmates, he was the last lottery choice to sign with Nike, and in addition, the surprise came the, uh, in the form of a multi-year sneaker agreement with Nike. They signed Tyler Hero following his outstanding performance in the Summer League, where he made 24 out of 25 three throws, meaning uh, dating back his, to his time in Kentucky, has now made 111 of his last 118 attempts with a total of 94% accuracy. He also averaged 19.8 points, 4.5 rebounds, 4.3 assists, and 1.5 steals in four games. Tyler frequently wears Nike sneakers, switching between iconic styles like Nike Kobe Proto V and the Nike Zoom Freak One. He, he joins people like uh, Ja Morant, DeAndre Hunter, Darius Garland, Jackson Hayes, and Cam Reddish to sign with the swoosh as the apparel company has added the most high-profile players in the 2019 class. Tyler, after being drafted, was gifted a watch by his teammate on his birthday. He might be a rookie, but he's turning into a veteran baller right before everyone's eyes as he copped out an insane diamond-filled chain, which was said to be around $30,000 worth. The ex-Kentucky star is currently averaging about 13.4 points a game and has already gotten praise from ex-Miami champs like Chris Bosh. Hero wanted to immortalize his own logo TH14 in bling, so he hit up the celebrity jeweler Iceman Nick to make it happen with whom he was linked uh, with through his teammate, where they met in Houston. Tyler was hooked up with a 14-carat gold pendant and 25 carats of VS1 white and blue diamonds and an iced-out 14 carats rose Cuban gold chain with 18-carat diamonds, making it all around a cost of 55,000 buckaroons. I should stop saying buckaroons. What am I, a pirate? Hero was not messing around either when he got his girlfriend Katya a stunning diamond-encrusted necklace showcasing the number 14, which is Tyler's jersey number his Instagram account. It's possible to see that above the diamond-studded number 14, there's a diamond-studded heart. The personalized necklace is the perfect gift for her as she's proudly Hero's biggest cheerleader and fan. Aside from his jewelry, he also has other accessories, like his glasses. During the interview, he made reference to his first designer glasses, which he said cost about a thousand bucks. I guess that's pretty good for some, uh, pretty good price for some Louis V's. You know, since then, he's bought 10 pairs of glasses, costing about $10,000 in total. He said Miami is a very sunny place, so he needs his glasses. I mean, come on. That's, that's, that's an A plus B equals AB logic. Dang, gosh darn it. I don't actually like math. I'm sorry if I've caused anyone any trauma. But also, like, $10,000 for a bunch of sunglasses? Talk about expensive, uh, protection. <laughs> I almost swore. Even when heading to the beach, Tyler Hero steps out in style. Tyler Hero revealed that he was also into artworks when he bought a $4,000 painting of um, himself, a portrait of himself from middle to high school to college, all the way to the pro leagues. He met the artist in Denver where they collaborated together, and he told the artist he wanted something where he grew over the years as a basketball player. Then the artist came up with the idea of this painting of him. He did say all the custom paintings around his house cost a whopping total of $10,000. It's, it's nice to see that he's an art lover, or a uh, himself lover. I'm sure he loves all kinds of art. And that's it, so thank you so much for watching my video.